Hey, what's up everyone? MacBoy here from MacBoy Productions. And today I'm going to be showing you how to make Firefox 3.0 or the latest version of Firefox on your Mac faster. Uh, there are tons and tons of tutorials out there on the internet and on YouTube. And I'm going to be sharing one that most appealed to me, that uh, worked for me the best and uh, the one that I found the, on the internet, like everyone else. Uh, I do not take any credit for this, I just found this on a website and I just did what they did and it actually made my Firefox faster. So I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Okay, so I get these questions all the time, how to make Firefox faster, how to make Safari faster, or how to make any browser faster. In Firefox particularly, when you launch it up, my home page here is Swagbucks, when you launch it up, uh, it's I believe it's a little slower than Safari 4. Uh, when you, even in YouTube page loading, if I go to YouTube, it's just slower in loading up. All the items, all the images are slower than YouTube, which is, that's my own personal belief. You have your own personal beliefs, all right? But uh, to make this faster, uh, I found a way on the internet to do this. So. The very first thing you need to do is you're going to need to go up to the address bar at the top and you're going to type about colon config. All right, this will take you to uh, the advanced settings of Firefox which you, where you can just change the stability, security, performance um, of the application. So just hit I'll be careful, I promise, and uh, you will uh, be brought up to a page with a lot of a lot of new items that you probably have, haven't seen. Well, anyways, at the top of that page, there's a filter uh, bar where you can type in something and it'll filter out. So uh, I just got the text that day that I found on the internet right here. This is the text. I just copied into text edit, and these are the exact instructions that I found. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is you need to copy network.http.pipelining and then copy that and then paste it into the filter. Then the very first thing when you see which is network.http.pipelining, double click it in the value of false right here and it should turn to true. And then the status should change to user set meaning it's it was changed by the user which is me. And default means the original setting that the application came to. Oops. All right. And then underneath it, you should see something like network.http.pipelining.maxrequests. And um, what you do to that, you double click on the 4 and uh, change that to 30. This is the value you're changing um, of it. So let me read what they have written here. Nor normally, the browser will take one request to a web page at a time. When you enable pipelining, it will make several at once, which really speeds up the page loading. So basically, you're not making... Uh, Firefox, the application itself faster, you're making the page loading faster, which uh, people see as making Firefox faster. But anyways, this is what you do. So it said set network.http.pipelining to true, which I have done, and then set the network.http.proxy pipeline to true. So this is another thing you have to copy right here and then paste it. All right, you find it. Uh, mine's already true because I forgot to undo it when I was making the video. Anyways, double click on this and then change it to true just like that. All right. Um, then change the network.http.pipelining .max request to 30, which we've done. And then lastly, click anywhere, go to new and then integer. Name it right here, whatever it says. Which is ng_layout_initial_paint_delay. Hit OK and then change the value to it. I believe just keep it zero. Yeah, the value should be zero. Once you've done that, uh, just quit out of Firefox and then you go to a new space, launch it. Uh, I can pretty much see that that was much faster than my initial startup uh, for Swagbucks. Again, even on YouTube. It makes it a bit faster there you see it was faster than before if you want to go back to the beginning of the video check that out I believe it is faster this is how you do it the exact instructions to how to do it are in the description go ahead and check that out and guys in the description you will find my Twitter my blog 
and my business email where you all can contact me for any questions, concerns, comments, or suggestions. Once again, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you like my wallpaper, you can download that from the link in the description too. And I will see every single one of you next time on Mac Boy Productions.